Hi guys, it's Kojo, Gigi, and Sky, an ordinary family that has chosen to do some extraordinary things like leaving our home in the USA to go to Ghana, West Africa, where we're exploring the whole country whilst touching the lives of children that are mostly HIV positive. After commissioning a new home in Agomenya near Accra, we came back exhausted. So we decided to take a day of rest in Accra before heading out to the Ashanti, the Brongahafu, the Northern, and the Volta regions of Ghana. Subscribe now to follow along our journey. So how long have you been driving the Uber? Five or six months now. Oh, okay. What, what were you doing before that? Actually, I was driving somebody like a chauffeur. Oh, you were a chauffeur? Why did you stop? Everybody wants like something best, and I think Uber is best for me than that. Oh. So it's like, but that one, you know. So you make your own schedule? My own schedule, that's what I mean. So that's what you like about Uber? Like you own your own business, right? Yeah, sure. Okay. So do you make good money with Uber? It's fine. It's not bad, right? Okay. You ask us, this is um, Tumberry, Ghana, and here it is. Half life family. That's the ice cream man. We have chocolate hazelnut, raspberry, So, I the can choose. We have a different waffle. We have a piece of green waffle, we have mini dead waffles, we have chocolate chips. Depends on the flavor you want to put in your waffle. Why is it all cereals? <laughs> a lot of cereal. You might as well bring milk. Stopping by Newberry. Have a nice day. Okay, I have that. I want that with that coco bag. Oh, Nessie. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Don't worry, blessings and favor will be on you today. <laughs> Do you have sugar in it already? Oh, 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 oh sugar. Oh, okay. really good. You're gonna If we see coconut somewhere, let me know. Eh? Good morning, thank you. Oh, I need you. This came with bread. <laughs> so give good cut money. You have a straw? Yeah. Thank you. Ah, what's it? You're a good business. Yeah, I did. I use cup. Uh, well, you have a cup, man. Thank you. Beat it, man. Yeah. 
Yeah. Breakfast every morning. Two cities. You get fresh coconut water, you get the white, that's it. Uh, Healthy. Yeah, this one was more white. That's okay. okay. Yeah, that's two, right? Oh, no, that's two. Coco King. And this package, the, the new thing in Ghana where there's cocoa wow. stands and it's like sky. <laughs> Though I don't drink this kind of milk, I got it. I got bread. And this is the cocoa package like this. Yay, good. With a cover. I think it's a pretty neat idea. It's like yeah. some upgrade of the regular cocoa salad. I like cocoa. I don't it's cocoa, say cocoa. Cocoa. It's not cocoa. 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 I don't know if this sugar will be enough, but we'll see. I don't, I don't like really sugar. like sugar. Not sugar. Okay. I do like Give it. Give me my other pack. <laughs> it's brown sugar. It's still not good enough. I wish I had honey. I'm going to Kamasi and I'm about to do my super big tag. Go don't go too me. close to the. <laughs> Okay, now I'm a little bit dizzy, kids. What do you want to do in Kamasi? Have a little tour at, 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 at the palace, at the uh, royal palace. Uh huh, at the royal palace. Are you having a good time so far on your trip? Yes. Yeah. What have you enjoyed the most? What do you like about Ghana the most? The pa the soccer? beach, the beach, and the soccer. Soccer. Soccer walkers. Okay, anything else? The beach, the soccer, and what else? Like fufu? No. No, mommy. No fufu. No fufu, okay. I mean fufu. And um, then that. And please don't miss my videos. And catch them before you miss them. Okay, where? Where, where, where can they catch them? Hmm. YouTube. YouTube. Okay. They yeah. have to you have to catch them right on YouTube. Kumasi 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 Kumasi. Be share my mum boy me na me pesi kadi afaka ku Kumasi. The credits in Dawson to me friend me mama ni ni ano wakati. Man and safe it my bass echo na me pesi kaku kumasi. Me mama yaka baby te busi afu go be a new walk mukasi. We just arrived in Kumasi, which is in the Ashanti region of Ghana. It's actually right in the middle of Ghana. Um, so there's no ocean here. Um, as a Ghanaian born and raised half of my life in Ghana, I only came to Kumasi once, which was to check out the university. To check it out because when I was in high school, I was interested in going there for university. I ended up at the University of Delaware. Big difference. but. In any case, we're here today because it's one of the places we want to explore and we want to show you. Um, coming here, what it took us about, what, four hours or five hours. Um, we saw places like um, Suhum, Nkoko, Kwewu. Go, go, Kojo, Kojo said Kwewu. Konongo. Konongo. You know, it's interesting looking along the road. A lot of people seem to be carvers and work with clay what else do they seem to be into hunters. they're hunters yeah because they're inland there's a lot of forests around so a lot of hunters holding like live animals they've caught that wouldn't let us take pictures of them i don't know why they got really antsy when they saw the camera so we didn't get any pictures or videos of them but um it seems to be what people do here farming and um, carving and clay molding and all this stuff unlike the central and western region where most people are like fishermen because they're right along the coast there comes a time when we hit a certain call when the world must come together as one there are people dying oh, when it's time to lend a hand to life, the greatest gift of all. You can help break the silence. Talk about HIV and AIDS. We are the chicken. We are the chicken. 
After an early start, a long drive, and an afternoon at St. Patrick's Hospital, where we donated food and clothing to families dealing with HIV, we were exhausted, so we decided to stay at the Golden Bean Hotel. This hotel was amazing. Unfortunately, due to technical difficulties, we've lost all footage and pictures, so these were taken from their website. The buffet was endless. From breakfast to dinner, everything tasted delicious, and the staff was super friendly. We truly had a great experience at this hotel. Even their internet worked better than most places. So we had a good night rest and then woke up the next day to work out and do yoga in their beautiful gardens. The only footage we found was of Sky on this yoga mat. We then headed out to do some sightseeing. <laughs> got to the Mansha Palace. We're still in Kumasi and we are really excited to go in to learn more about the Ashanti Kingdom. We hope you're enjoying all our videos so far. We've been to the central region, the western region. Um, we went to Agomenya briefly and now we are in Kumasi, the Ashanti region. Follow along. We probably won't be able to make a lot of videos or take a lot of pictures in there but we'll share with you as much as we can. Yeah, so just follow along and subscribe, okay? Stay tuned. Thanks. Okay, let's go. Bye, come on. out of the Manchia Palace Museum pretty much and it was very enlightening we learned a lot about the Asante Kingdom how brave they were how they fought everything they went through Yeah, Santua, all the kings yeah very enlightening honestly I didn't even <laughs> it's kind of sad to say but I didn't even know about this palace um, so yeah it, it, it was great to hear more about the Asante culture and Asante's history, you know, um, and now it makes me wonder uh, what the history is of other, other tribes mm -hmm. and whether it was as well preserved as, as the Ashanti's. You know? It was great. You will see, you know, some of the pictures in the video. Yeah. We hope you enjoy it. Remember to subscribe and yeah. there's more ahead. So subscribe so you can see all the videos we have coming up. Yeah. Thank you guys for following Ciao. Bye. It was getting dark by the time we headed out of Kumasi to head to the northern region. Since we are traveling the whole country by car, we've decided never to travel at night for safety reasons. We were directed to the Falls Palace Hotel in a town called Kintampo on our way to the north. The hotel seemed deserted at first, so we were surprised to find people in there who checked us in. They were very nice, although the hotel didn't meet our standards. If we have to choose between driving at night and staying in a hotel like this, we choose to stay in a hotel. Also recognizing that it could be worse. We had a great night's sleep and woke up to a beautiful sunrise. We also realized that the hotel wasn't that bad after all and was located near some beautiful attractions such as this waterfall. We knew nothing about the waterfall so didn't plan to visit it. We hope to do so next time. We gathered our team and got back on the road again to head to the north. If you would like to support our cause and our work with HIV positive children, please feel free to visit charlotteslight.org. You can also find us on Instagram at Pack Light Family. Thank you so much and please remember to subscribe.